Hey everyone, how's it going? In today's video, I'm going to be showing you how to draw a cartoon version of Suko from the new Godzilla and Kong The New Empire. Now make sure if you like these videos, you click and subscribe and turn on the notifications so you can always be notified for when a new video pops up. So thanks for watching and I hope you enjoy. Now to start off with cartoon Suko, let's begin with the eyes. So I'm going to start right here and I'm going to begin by making a circle for one of the eyes. Then I'm going to leave some space and I'll draw another circle right over here for the other eye. Next, let's make the nose. I'm going to begin by making a little curve line like this. And then we'll do the same thing over here. We'll put another little curve line right there. Inside of it, I'm going to color in two little black ovals for the nostrils. Down here, let's make a little smiley face for the mouth. And I always like to put another little one underneath here for some detail. Now, let's shape out the head. So I'm going to begin here. And I'm just going to draw a line that's just going to curve around. We're going to come down and then bring it to here. Next, let's make the bottom of the face. So I'm going to start here. I'm going to draw a line that's just going to come down and then up in like a smiley face shape. Now, let's make the side of the head. So I'm going to begin right here, and I'm going to curve a line that comes up. And I'll do the same thing here. I'm going to curve a line that's going to come up. Then let's draw half of an oval shape on each side for the ears. Then let's go ahead and put a little line inside of here. Next, I'm going to bring this line up, and I'm going to put some little points on it, just to show some fur. Next, we'll do the same thing here. We're just going to come down with some points, and then we'll come up with a few little points. Now, let's work on the body. Starting here, I'm going to draw a line that's just going to come down. It's going to curve around and then come up to here. We're going to make a little line that curves in on each side for its chest. And then we're going to put a couple little lines on here just for his stomach. Now, let's work on his arms. I'm going to start here, and I'm going to make some little zigzag lines that come down on each side. So we're just going to make these little pointed lines that come down. Next, I'll make a zigzag line across on each one. Then we're going to put some more zigzag lines up into the body. You can see the kind of curve. Now starting here, I'm going to draw a line that curves out and in on each side. Then I'm going to make a little line that comes down on each side. Next I'm going to draw a line that's going to curve around. We just go down and up. Then we go down and up and down and up here. Same thing, down and up, down and up here. Now, starting here, I'm going to make a couple little points that come down on each side. Then I'm going to make a couple little points that just kind of curve down to start the legs.
I'll make a little zigzag line across on each side. Then I'm going to curve this up on each side and make a little line across to connect it. Now for the feet, let's draw a line that's going to come out. We're going to go down and back in. We'll do this again. Again right here. And then we'll just bring it over and up. Same thing, we're going to come out down and in, over, down and in, and then over, down, in, and then we'll bring it up here for the foot. Next, I'm just going to make a couple little kind of like W shapes all around here on the body. Even on top of the head, we'll make some little M shapes up here, just to add a little bit of fur. And there you go, there is your drawing of a cartoon Suko. I'm going to fast forward and start coloring this. Thanks for watching, hope you enjoyed.